Welcome back to the Hockey Shop Source for Sports. I'm here in Goalie Utopia with Cam Matwiv and Goalie Utopia just got a little bit brighter. Um, I know we've already talked about the new True line, uh, powered by Lefebvre a couple weeks ago uh, when they launched the customizer, let you know that you could order them uh, already from Cam. But at that time, we thought we might be a few months away from actually having inventory in store. Well, guess what? As you can see, we no longer have to Photoshop it in. Cam has his inventory, which means if you have questions about the new True line, he's got the 12.2 in stock. If you happen to be lucky enough, like us, to live in the Lower Mainland, you can come visit him in person at the hockey shop, Source for Sports here in Surrey. Get your hands on it. You know, check the flex, feel the glove, uh, feel the blocker, really get a feel for this gear. The other good thing is that means Cam's gotten a better feel for this gear. So if you're not blessed enough to be able to sort of come and check it out in person, he's better equipped to answer your questions. It's more than just a catalog. It's an actual real feel for him now. So mm -hmm. once again, the place to come if you've got questions about the true gear by Lefebvre, Cam Matwiv at the hockey shop. And let's just walk through it again really quickly here. Um, we highlighted some of the features before. Uh, let's show off a little bit of the, like, for example, the flex and feel of the 12.2 pad. Yeah, so again, we have our two sample sets here. So just to iterate to as well, I have something for you to touch and hold. Right now, these are staying in the store, though. They're not going to be for sale at this current moment. Um, I should have some more general stock kind of arriving closer uh, to about September. That all said, back to the pad. So flexibility-wise. Start off with that boot, because that's something that uh, basically everybody has said or mentioned since uh, since we've had these in. Very, very flexible boot. Something more so than you've been used to in the past. The good news about that is, is that that'll really help you in a reverse V8 situation or even a VH situation. That's helping you get over top of your pad, getting you better balance, so you're able to catch that edge and push off, as opposed to the pad shooting up your leg as you go to go do that. It's flexing with you, staying on the top of the, the boot of the skate and allowing you to kind of get over top. Yeah, and really important, especially if you're a goaltender that likes to wear their pads tight and really sort of fit firmly to the leg so that that pad is moving with your leg rather than around it. You can sort of maintain that tight connection in the bottom of the boot through the shin. And like as Cam said, that pad's still going to give you the flexibility at the bottom to sort of load up those pushes um, with the pad sort of staying in place rather than slide, having to slide around and move around your leg. So it'll move with your leg a little more. Some of the other features, pretty stiff. That's the thigh rise. Yes. So a couple different options as you're ordering custom. Uh, this one we set to single break, but stiff upper top. Um, just kind of following more in line with the trends that uh, some of the other pads that are out on the wall. Um, quite stiff, but that gives you good rigidity and also will aid in the seal of the pad as you actually uh, are in down into the butterfly position. Okay, we talked about the new fast rotation system last time, but we couldn't really show it off other than some stock photos we had. Now we can. Open up the back of this pad. We do have the fast rotation system. So, like I said, again, to me, like it almost looks like a reverse knee brace. <laughs> it's, it's quite close. Um, that said, you do have that adjustability in terms of how tight you do want it. That said, even at its kind of loosest setting, it is fairly on the snug side of things, and that's what it's supposed to do. Um, I found uh, even with like what I would consider bigger than your average calf, it still tends to sit right. It doesn't really have that ride up feature that uh, some of these pads do have now with that, like their different rotation systems and whatnot. Um, that said, great connection to the pad, great response out of the pad so far. Uh, in terms of initial feedback, plus even just messing around in the store myself. Um, definitely worth checking out. However, if you don't want it, you do have the ability to order with just two leather straps, and then that would get deleted. But okay. you'd be kind of missing out on one of the cooler features. Really quick, gloves, blockers. Um, not much has changed in terms of the options that are available. I know you have two here in store to check out in terms of feel. Obviously, you can see by the way that pocket folds over. Clearly, I have a 580 on my hand. Uh, the other glove we have here, I'll let Cam close this one, is a 590, more of a straight line break. You can also order it in the 600. Those are kind of the traditional you know, uh, break points that we saw when Lefebvre was making gear for CCM. To me, that feel and those break points are all kind of maintained here. That, that's correct. Yeah, it, this shouldn't feel like a departure if you're already used to, you know, those previous Lefebvre gloves uh, that have existed in the past. Um, you should find a comfortable home. Internals feel very, very close and identical. Um, same thing with that uh, 580 closure. 
Uh, again, 600 is available. Just didn't order it at this current time, but I believe we do have some coming in for that September date. Two well, different options for the blocker. I was going to say, well, the one you've got over on your side has some binding on it. This one is more of a bindingless design. What are some of the other options you can get with your blocker? That said, basically completely identical blockers beyond the binding itself. That straight versus curved finger protection. Curved is currently featured on this one uh, as well. Uh, I believe that one has it as well. Um, again, if you're used to those CCM blockers, used to those old previous Lafayette blockers, this isn't going to feel too much different. You still have the option of the full piece cuff or the half piece cuff. Both of these have the full. Um, very easy to get the, the blocker in front of you um, to provide that good uh, face forward position. Um, again, that good familiar feeling gear. So if you're already used to it, here's your chance to get it again. Okay. so. As he said, if you're in the area, you can come by, check it out, get hands on and really give it a good feel. Um, if you're not, Cam's can answer all your questions. There are different ordering options for custom. As he said, he'll have stock retail versions in store later on this summer. But for now, at least you can get your hands on it. I know a lot of you have been waiting and Cam is better equipped even, even more than before to answer your questions. So make sure if you've got questions, where can they get a hold of you? 604-589-8299. And the 1-800 number for our U.S. clients? 1-800-567-7790. Well done. He's got it memorized, folks. All right. Whether it's custom order, wait times now, like this this arrived faster than you expected? Or have we seen the wait times bump up if you're going full custom? Uh, give me a call. We'll talk about it. All right. We'll leave it at that, but there will be some more in store. The new True by Lefebvre. Uh, you've seen it in the NHL. Now you can get your hands on it in person here at the hockey shop. Thanks, Kevin.